series, the Balmer series is the only series that lie in the visible range. The notation for the four wavelengths found in the Balmer series are either H or BA alpha at 656 nanometers, beta at 486 nanometers, gamma at 434 nanometers, and delta at 410 nanometers corresponding to the colors, red, cyan, blue, and violet. In Balmer's formula, the wavelength lambda is equal to Balmer's constant times n squared divided by n squared minus m squared, where m is equal to 2 and n is equal to an integer that's greater than 2, but less than 7. The value of Balmer's constant is 3.6450682 times 10 to the minus 7 meter. identify hydrogen's four spectral lines. If n is equal to 3, then lambda is equal to Balmer's constant, 3.6450682 times 10 to the minus 7 meter, times 3 squared divided by 3 squared minus 2 squared. 3 squared divided by 3 squared minus 2 squared is equal to 1.8. Therefore, lambda is equal to Balmer's constant times 1.8. And lambda will equal 6.561 times 10 to the minus 7 meter. To convert meters to nanometers, simply multiply by 1.0 times 10 to the 9 nanometers per meter. This will equal 656 nanometers. And 656 nanometers will create the red line found in hydrogen's bright line spectrum. Four, the wavelength will equal Balmer's constant times 4 squared divided by 4 squared minus 2 squared. This equals Balmer's constant times 1.333. Balmer's constant times 1.333 is equal to 4.86 times 10 to the minus 7 meter. And of course to convert meters to nanometers we multiply by 1.0 times 10 to the 9 nanometers per meter. This will equal a wavelength of 486 nanometers. This wavelength represents the cyan or greenish-blue 
line found in Hodgkin's bright light spectrum. If n is equal to 5, then the factor generated will be 1.19. So lambda will equal Barmer's constant times 1.19, which is equal to 4.3376 times 10 to the minus 7 meters. And of course, multiplying 4.3376 times 10 to the minus 7 meters by 1.0 times 10 to the 9 nanometer per meter will equal 434 nanometers. And 434 nanometers represents the blue line found in Hydra's bright line spectrum. And finally, when n is equal to 6, the result of the four calculations will be 410 nanometers. 410 nanometers represents the violet line found in hydrogen's bright light spectrum. This concludes my explanation of how to use Balmer's formula to determine hydrogen's bright line spectrum. Hopefully this video has been helpful. Thanks for watching.